back to the door. Damn, this is some primo sushi. Primo. The slices are huge. Man, I'm starving. Can we eat? Hey, where are Aige-san and Ikutsuki-san? He took it to the lab for a tune-up or something. He said they'll join us later. <laughs> the chairman just can't stay away from the lab, can he? That must be my father. Oh? You invited him around? Whoa, I forgot how cool he looks. We've been waiting for you. So it's finally over then. That's right. Uh, who's he? Can't you tell? That's Kirijo Senpai's dad. She looks exactly like him. Uh, I don't know if I'd go that far. You think so? <laughs> yeah, man, it's the eye patch. It really makes them You've match. Well. No words can express my gratitude. Though you'll never receive the recognition you deserve, your achievement was truly monumental. Thank you, really. <laughs> to you, I owe a special thanks. For lending us your power until the very end. Oh, it was no big deal. I love her startled look. Thanks to you, the twelve shadows behind all this chaos have been destroyed. You've carried this burden long enough. You deserve a chance to experience the joys of youth. As of midnight tonight, the specialized extracurricular execution squad will be disbanded. Disbanded? Oh, right. No longer must you risk your lives in battle. Tomorrow, you can triumphantly return to a normal school life. Is something the matter? Nah, it's nothing. All right, everyone. It's time to celebrate. Your feast awaits. And don't worry about holding back. Eat as much as you'd like. Music to my ears. Sweet. Freaking finally! Nom, 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 nom. Listen up, everyone. Now that we're good and stuffed, how about we take a picture together? Sure. A picture? I'd like Igis to be here, though. Actually, I did try to take one last night. Except I forgot it doesn't work during the dark hour. You mean you brought a camera with I can't with believe Igis hasn't been here for the party. Well, yeah. Why would Akutsuki take her away our last battle during the celebration? <laughs> kind of a dick Excuse move. Excuse me, mister. You mind taking our picture? Ugh, I feel like such a tourist. But, you know, I do kind of want a picture, too. Oh, wait. Akutsuki san and Aigis aren't here. Ah, fuck Akutsuki san. We don't later. need him in the picture. <laughs> All right, everyone, get together. Come on, squeeze and tide. Everyone, get real close to me. You want me close, too? Uh, no, not you. Ken holding Koromaru is Jeez, adorable. Don't make the poor camera guy wait all day. Hey, we're good to go. You can take the picture whenever. How's this for a pose? Hey, get your hand out of my face! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. Is it just me, or did this not get my good side? <laughs> We'll just take another one when I guess and Akutsuki san get back, alright? Yes, yes, we hear you. I could really get used to this worry free lifestyle. Well, I got real bad news for you. It's about to be very How much you, not Koro worry free. Are you excited for all this meat? The celebration party continues. I spent a moment of relaxation with my battle weary friends. Oh, there's another C's rank up. That's funny. I said, didn't I? I was like, well, this is, this is, there's no way that there's like half the game left. So this is going to have to start ranking up much faster. And then it's literally like two days apart. <laughs> hey, how come nobody's eating? Don't tell me you're Bro, the already. food's basically gone. Are you kidding? I'm stopped. Yeah, me too. I couldn't eat another bite. How about you, senpai? I'm good for now. Nah, suit yourself. <laughs> Tori Mori wants some more. Maru, you hungry? Yes. Don't give the 
dog raw fish. You'll make him sick. All oh, right. Mm, but I want raw fish. I guess an akutsuki san sure are running late. My sasometer with the kutsuki it's is like through the roof. And there it is. Yep, I, I said, didn't I? I was like, I wonder if this party is going to last until midnight, and then they'll see the dark hour start and be like, huh. The hell? Yeah, about that. Those guys in the suits transmogrified. Wait, Mitsuru's dad the didn't transmogrify. Still happening? Senpai, what's going on? Does Mitsuru's dad have a persona? I'm not sure. Guess I was right to have my doubts. No one else is questioning this? Yeah, something didn't feel right. Did I did I know that he didn't get fucked by the Dark Hour? I don't remember this information, but if we got this info, then it would have been like when we went on the summer holiday, which was a long time ago, so I guess I would have just forgot. No one else is questioning it, so I guess it's not something strange. <sighs> Say what? Hey, do you hear that? It sounds like a bell, but where's it coming from? Where is Ikutsuki? And he hasn't even called. What could he be doing with Aegis that's making him so late? <sighs> Mitsuru? He's sus. Everyone, prepare to move out. We're heading for Tartarus. Oh, okay. Um, to do what? I don't know. But that's where the sound is coming from. We have to find out what's going on. Um... Ikutsuki-san. I guess? What are you doing here? <sighs> She's simply here to fulfill her role. As a weapon. He's so sus. This is. I'm right. I've been right what? from day one, haven't I? Kutsuki san, what are you trying to pull? You said the Dark Hour and Tartarus would disappear if we defeated the Twelve Shadows. Bro was That's the imposter. Fighting this whole the time. imposter is so sus. Why? What are you trying to accomplish? Destroying the shadows, getting rid of the Dark Hour. It was all a lie, wasn't it? You've known since the beginning. Excellent deduction, Kirijo kun Unfortunately, fucking knew it. you're too little too late. You motherfucker, you let Chidori no. fucking waltz through there with Jinpei. You tricked us? It's all going just as I planned. It's no accident that the Dark Hour and Tartarus continue to exist. I never intended for you to rid the world of them. Quite the opposite, in fact. What do you mean? The Twelve Shadows were parts of a whole. They were destined to be reunited. And thanks to your diligence, that destiny has been fulfilled. Okay, so they were parts of a whole, and killing them reunited them. And when we did that, Pharos got his memories back. So Pharos is the reunion of all the... all the separated parts of the Shadows. So is Pharos actually going to be, like, the villain behind... I mean, Akutsuki's clearly, like lesser villain. I don't think Akutsuki is going to be like surprise final boss, but Pharos might be. Pharos might be the final boss if he's all the shadows like reformed into one kind of thing. Because he got his memories back when the last one died. Death. The Almighty yeah! Fucking... Soon arise and bring forth the fall. I was one text box away, man. I was a singular text box away. He's the Death Arcana and we maxed him out. Son of a bitch. What are you saying? Why would you want that? I've been chilling with the final boss in my bedroom for the last year, for fuck's sake. The end shall come and okay, free that's this a face. world from despair. It will be the death of everything, but also the beginning. What is he saying? Is he out of his mind? You see, I too was a scientist on the project ten years ago. The experiment did go awry. But that wasn't the reason the Dark Hour and Tartarus came to be. They manifested as a result of harvesting the Shadow's power. 
just as the experiment was designed to do. That's why your grandfather gathered so many shadows. To initiate the fall. That can't be. Humanity has overrun this world, turning it into a barren void in the process. The only hope of salvation lies in ruin. According to the prophecy, the fall will be orchestrated by a prince. And once he has delivered us all, he shall rule the new world as king. The attempt years ago failed, but the time has come at last. I am that prince. That's some coke, my guy. This is insane. Are you serious with this shit? I do apologize for deceiving you, but all your hard work has paved the way for the future. I guess I hope Stay you're not actually on his side, side right now. For just a bit longer. I hope you that you have been programmed salvation. and forced to stay with him. Find it how? By dying? I have a question for you. And what's that? In that video from my dad, he said the shadows had to be defeated. Was that a lie too? Ah, uh, that was in fact his recording. Of course, I had to modify it to my specifications. You doctored it? Such an unsavory way to phrase it. Your father, Eiichiro Takeba, was a superb scientist. He didn't know me at the time, but I truly respected him. While others focused on the Shadow's abilities, his research led him somewhere far deeper. But unfortunately, he couldn't comprehend the magnificent potential of the fall. What? He left that recording at the expense of his life. So it seems. But it did come in quite handy. I'm sure he'd be happy knowing that. So you were behind it all? You used my dad! And me too! Used is such an ugly word. It had to be done for the sake of the world. Our job is to right the wrongs of the past. And we intend to do just that. Tell him, Mizuru. Senpai, what are you- <sighs> I was hoping you'd be able to see the light. But you are just kids, after all. Maybe my expectations were too high. I guess. Uh, it's time you fulfilled your role. Oh, has she been reprogrammed? Prepare them for sacrifice. Oh, she must have Understood. been. She must have been reprogrammed. Energy output at maximum. However, there is a chance that she overcomes her programming, right? There is a chance that she becomes more human and is no longer able to be fucking controlled. What's wrong? I guess, please! Engaging. Shit, maybe not yet. Oh, hello. It's cutscene time. Oh my god, okay. What the fuck? What the fuck? I don't like that. The Gekugan High School Observatory, now a part of Tartarus. What's going on here? What? He's turned up as well? <laughs> it seems I was unconscious. What the hell? What is this? <sighs> Damn it! I can't get these off! Ikutsuki, what is the meaning of this? It's exactly what it looks like. They are our sacrifices. Harbingers of the fall. All the pieces are in place. Bro, five now, seconds ago you were telling us that we could join you. Shall be fulfilled. And now you need us as sacrifices? What? 
bastard! You're full of shit! My, my, how lively. I guess... Affirmative. Father! You traitor! Are you insane? Far from it. You know, your father was an unfortunate man. After all this time, even his own son can't comprehend his vision. My father was wrong. Death as deliverance is an ideology no one should ever embrace. You fool. You've become nothing but a burden. I guess this man will be our first sacrifice. Surely not. Now, Do not let I guess kill him. him in front of his fucking daughter. Surely not. No. Please, I guess don't. <laughs> Overcome it, I guess. What are you doing, I guess? She's resisting. I. I. Fine. I'll no. Do it myself. Block it. Block it. Ten years. I've wasted ten long years. Come on, I, I am guess. Not like your father. I won't make any exceptions. Come on, I guess. <sighs> you got this. You got this. <laughs> Who fired? <laughs> no. Oh, you motherfucker. Father! Fuck me. Oh, they both got the shot off. Oh, okay. I guess execute the sacrifices now. She's clearly not fucking listening to you anymore, dickhead. I guess. Hey, come on. I know you wouldn't do this. She literally just protected the dad. What? You just protected the dad. Are you just Do in the it, middle I of a guess. fucking, like, electronics on the frets? <laughs> she's fighting it still. I thought she'd overcome it, but I guess she's still in the middle of fighting it. Yeah, your whole fucking purpose is to protect me, right? Oh, That is very cute. Remember the good times, I guess. Come on. Fucking 180. Okay, you. <laughs> Fucking what? shot the chains out. I guess. What? Father. You good for nothing failure of a machine. Kill him right now. I'll do it. <laughs> yes, who's a good fucking boy? Koromaru. Who is the best fucking boy? It's all over, Chairman. <laughs> you don't get it, do you? Why do you waste your time searching for a reason to live in this broken world? There's no point to it at all. The only possible way to fix this is to start over! <laughs> nice. Yes. Yes, I was chosen. I'm going to be the god of the new world! Bro, you're coping so hard right now. You are about to take a tumble. What a shame. I was so close. <laughs> Out the airlock you go, motherfucker. <laughs> Ikutsuki was the imposter. Damn, I'm so sorry, Mitsuri. Fucking hell. Fucking hell. Had to watch her dad get killed in front of her? Jesus Christ. How did it come to this? Jesus Christ, man. This game is fucking dark. This is way darker than fucking Persona 5. Persona 5, like... It was pretty dark with some of the Akechi stuff. And, like, he did sort of kill Joker, but not really, obviously. But, like... Yeah, is is not really <laughs> comparing the the levels of dark of uh, of P3 and P5. This uh, definitely definitely fucking ramps it up to a million. Main characters fucking dying left, right, and center. Fucking people watching their close family get murdered in front of them. Fucking a ten-year-old kid talking about how he's gonna kill himself. <laughs> like what the fuck? Jesus, man. 
Ikutsuki-san. Father. Father. Oh, man. I'm so sorry, Mitsuri. Father. My father once made a promise. He swore he would atone for putting our generation in danger even if it cost him his life. But I... I wanted him to live. I became a Persona user so I could protect him. <laughs> Mitsuru slumped to the floor, crying like a child. Soon the dark hour will end. Sonata picked up the stunned Mitsuru. Everyone returned to the dormitory in silence. Christ, man. Yesterday was a shocking turn of events, indeed. I wonder if Mitsuru will be alright. I mean, yeah, eventually. Give it a lot of time. Oh, man. She's not going to be alright anytime soon. That is for sure. What's going to happen to us all now? Huh, I just fucking realized they totally ripped this plotline off for Persona 5 Strikers. They like actually ripped that plotline straight out of P3 and dumped it into Strikers. You got the robot girl who's on your team since early on and then is programmed by the bad guy to turn against you and then overcomes it with the power of friendship and the bad guy is someone that you've known since the start and they're like the sciencey one that's always in the lab and surprise they were the bad guy all along and yeah that's uh huh that is that is a pretty copy paste fucking storyline right there that is i'm glad i played it this way round i guess i would if i I feel like if I'd played this first and then played Strikers, I would have seen what they were doing and I'd have been like, huh, they literally copy pasted this. But because I played that one first, I wasn't necessarily thinking of it like the potential of a copy paste occurring because I knew that this game was released first. So I just wasn't really thinking of it the same way. But I think if I'd played them the other way around, I might have actually thought of that and just seen the same beats play out and been pretty fucking disappointed by it, I guess. I don't know. Hmm. Anyway, from incredible fucking sadness, depression, and tears to the gossipy students. Mm -hmm. Did you hear? Well, actually. The student council president's father died from an illness, right? I can't even imagine what it's like to lose a parent. Oh my god. Yeah, I think I'll help my mum with some chores when I get home. The first bell is rung. Bum, 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 bum. Feels really weird to just be going straight back into school and everything. It's a message from Sonata. I want to touch base with everyone on where we're at. Come to the lounge as soon as you get back. Alright. Looks like they cleared out the chairman's room. Well, no surprise there. <laughs> they got on that shit fast. Tychus isn't here either. I just can't believe all this. It's in the papers, too. Kirijo Group CEO dies suddenly. They're blaming it on an illness, though. Wait, does that make... <sighs> yeah, it's never the truth. Is it? Is it like a... I don't know if it's a private company or like... Is it... Does it because he died does it get passed on to Mitsuru is Mitsuru the new CEO or is it is it gonna be like there's a whole fucking board and they're gonna be appointing a new CEO that is like nothing to do with Mitsuru kind of thing I don't know I don't know if we've heard how that company operates exactly nope Grijo senpai is not here huh she's an only child so there's a lot to be settled like the funeral and the family business. She'll probably have her hands full for at least a week. 
true. That sounds rough. I hope she'll be okay. Same, dude. So, what are we supposed to do now? <gasps> What'll happen to Chidori? No word yet. They're probably too busy to be thinking about that. In fact, the entire Kirijo group must be in a state of panic. I hope I guess it's okay. It must be it must be kept in the family, right? Because it was his dad. It was Kirijo's granddad that was running it before, that was the dickhead one, and then he died, and it passed to his son, who was a good one. So I guess it must be a family business. So yeah, I guess Mitsuru would then, as an only child, be the next person taking it over? Yeah. Man. I want to hear what they have to say, but they haven't made a peep. Am I supposed to just wait for them to get their act together? Mitsuru is meeting with the company execs. It might explain the delay. Yeah, but still, what are we going to do? We have no idea how to get rid of the Dark Hour. We don't even know who to fight now. Well, we probably have we to climb to the top of Tartarus. The fall. What would have happened if we were sacrificed? I can't even imagine. I imagine the final boss has got to be at the top of Tartarus, right? I'm going to walk up there and Faris is going to be like, Yo! Nice to see you. Many unanswered questions. Yeah, but standing around here isn't gonna solve anything, right? True, but there is one thing we know Tartarus is still around and shadows are swarming the place. We should train so we're ready for whatever we might be up against. Right. All right, that's it for tonight. Try to get some rest, even if you can't sleep. Okay. Roger that. Roger, roger. Oh, right! Yukari-chan! Hmm? What's this? A disc? Um, there were traces of a video on the chairman's PC. The original? was deleted, but I was able to restore The undoctored version and, of her dad's message? Well, I think it's something you need to see. Thanks, Fuka. I'll be sure to watch this later. Mm hmm Just don't forget! So it's just a normal DVD? Alright, let's see what's on here. Oh, there we go. I can only hope that this recording reaches someone with a conscience. Isn't this... that video? My employer yep. has become obsessed with a loathsome idea. This experiment should never have been conceived. That's why I had to do something to put a stop to it. <laughs> However, in doing so, I released a number of shadows that are certain to torment future generations. But I didn't have a choice. If I didn't do this, it could have destroyed the entire world. I Please. see. He's the person that split, I assume, Pharos into 12 parts. Do not hunt the shadows that have dispersed. Uh -huh. This part's... I wasn't able to do anything to stop this madness. That's what he did. He, he was the one that split it. Word, I say. He's been seduced by the devil's temptations. Those monsters will try to reunite and become one again. If they succeed, then we're all doomed. I'll say it once more. Do not go after the shadows that were released! This is the original video. The real one. Before Gutsky went and tampered with it. Dad was trying to put a stop to the experiment. There's not much hope for me now. I have just one request. Whoever finds this, please give my daughter Yukari this message. I know I promised I'd be home soon. And I'm sorry to break that promise. But I want you to know, as your father, I was never happier in my life than when I was with you. This really is my dad. I love you, Yukari. Please, take care of yourself. Dad? Fucking hell, man. Dad? <laughs> I know one thing for sure now. I was right to believe in you. I'm doing okay. It took a while, but I finally got your message. 
Oh, evolution time. Whoa. Okay, that looks fucking sick. That is an upgrade. The resolution in Yukari's heart has awakened a new persona. Yukari's persona, Ayo, has given rise to Isis. Next magic attack will deal more than double the damage for all allies. Ooh. Ooh, that is very interesting. I wonder if that stacks. Do you think Tranquility stacks with Concentrate? If Mitsuru concentrates, and then when Yukari's turn comes up, she Tranquilities, and then Mitsuru's turn comes up and she Theogies, does it double it with Concentrate and then double it again with Tranquility? To quadruple it? I wonder. I wonder. I'll fight for what that I believe. That would probably be too overpowered, but then it's a theogy. Right, Dad? So it's not like it would happen often. I don't know. Hmm. Let me know if you know. Because I am very curious if that is a thing that can occur. Wow. Fuck me. I mean... <laughs> Limited set meals on today. <laughs> Yay. That's crazy. Where do we go from here, man? Like, obviously we're gonna have to get to the top of the tower. I'm, I'm assuming the final boss will be at the top of the tower. And now I'm assuming that final boss will be Pharos. Another video arrived? Nope. Yeah, it does definitely definitely feels like Faris is the final boss. He, he is death. He is the death arcana. And uh, that seemed to be what Akuski was rambling on about. <laughs> the death will descend. And also, Faris got all his memories back when we fucking destroyed the final shadow. So said, oh, it's a shame I've remembered. I've got to peace out now. I've got to dip. So, yeah. But, like, is there anything keeping us to the fucking full moon schedule now, actually? Because it's like, the next full moon is Wednesday the 2nd of, of November, but with the, with the shadows gone, is there any reason we would adhere to this schedule anymore? Like, is there is there some big threat coming at the next full moon, or is there not? Wait, no. We we just did the November one. What am I talking about? The next one is the second of December. Yeah. So yeah, is there is there a threat coming on the second of December, or is it just like? Go to Tartarus and grind as fucking much as you possibly can right now, or what? Hmm. Got finals that week. Well, there's a lot to think about. There is certainly a lot to think about. That is, I guess, where we will leave it for today. Crazy stuff. Insane stuff. I can't imagine how we're just going to go back to, like, regular daily life simulator after this, but I guess we're going to. Mitsuru, I'm surprised Mitsuru's persona didn't evolve when she, uh, when she saw what happened and everything up there. Maybe it will soon or something. How's, who, who actually has the double persona at the moment? Yukari's got hers. Junpei does not. Akihiko does, he was the first. Mitsuru obviously doesn't. I guess does not. Ken does. Korumaru does. No, Korumaru had two to start with. And I guess the reason Koromaru had two to start with is that he's not going to have an awakening thing. Presumably. They thought it... I guess they probably thought it would be a bit silly to have the dog have, like, a big emotional moment where he gets a new persona or something, so they were just like, fuck it, give him two to begin with. Maybe. Interesting. All right, well, that is it for today. Let's pop a cheeky save. We are at 82 and a half hours, level 60. And we are, I guess, now closing in on the end game with the 12 shadows behind us. 
I guess we would probably consider this end game now. So yeah, we'll see where we go from here in the next part. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, if you could leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Share the videos around, share the playlist around if you can. I would really appreciate that. And I'll see you next time for more Persona 3 Reload. Thanks for watching. See you then.